It's 20 to 10, and you're right to do 100 miles. Solo. What time do you reckon you're going to finish? Six. <laughs> Six? 6 p.m.? I'm going to do 4 p.m.? I'm going to have it done in an hour and a half. Juiced up. Where are you cycling to? I'm going through Milton Keynes. I'm going round Northampton. Where, where is my final destination? Why are you going to your final destination? Okay, well, I'm going to my final destination because it's a new bike day for you. <laughs> <laughs> Which is also why you're not riding. Which is also very exciting. And also you've got man flu, so all is forgiven. But yeah, we're going to, I'm going to meet you to pick up new bikes. We're going to Rutland in, in where? What, what is the location? Rutland. <laughs> oh, it's Rutland it's in Rutland. Rutland. <laughs> Rutland in Rutland. Rutland water, yeah. Whitwell. Whitwell. Okay, right. I'm going to Whitwell. Out and car back. Crack on then, is it? Good morning. How are you doing? I am off on my first ever solo 100 miler this morning. I have got a bit of fog ahead of me. I think this will be the longest ride I've ever done on my Todd. So I'm quite excited. Solo adventure, Sunday to myself, and I'm buzzing. Sights behold, a few drafts there. I'm about 25k in. Drank so much liquid this morning that I'm already incredibly jealous of blokes dying for the loo. Riding solo, gonna have to find a nice little safe spot to pull over. Jealous I can't just whop me bits out. But it is what it is. Seen quite a few bikies on the road, which is brill. Uh, also, of course, with the good weather, lots of cars out and about. So the roads are unusually busy for a Sunday, which, you know, not a massive fan of, if I'm honest. First sign of good weather here in a blimmin' long time, so I don't blame them. Quick comfort start to pull a mini at some of the animals. I think I'm maybe about nearly 40k in. It's absolutely gorgeous to be out. I'm about to hit some new roads, so very much going into adventure territory. No idea what, where I'm going. It's like animal blimmin' farm out here today. Like I have crossed deer, horses, so many sheep, countless dogs, chickens, stopped for a duck to cross the road. Birds are singing. Oh, it's just magic. I haven't been on my bike outside in maybe about two weeks, maybe maybe 10 days. I did the crit race, um, which was obviously fab. I went out for a long ride and didn't feel too good on the ride. Had a bit of a funny turn, which I'll talk a little bit more about, but it kind of resulted in me having a few health checks over the last two weeks. Nothing to worry about, nothing too serious, but wanted to get some things checked out. So it meant I kind of scaled back on the whole effort sessions, um, smashing around outside. So I've been indoor training, doing quite a lot of zone two, getting through with a bit of drive to survive. Those long sessions indoors are, they're not easy, are they? Like you need a little something, something. I feel like my soul's been set on fire. Like my mental health is just instantly leveling up and not. Right, I'm gonna get back on the roads, have a quick snack. Isaac's gonna join me for the final coffee stop just before Rutland, where he's picking up his new bike. Very excited to show you that. Very excited that he's got one. He's done cycle to work scheme, which is brilliant in terms of, you know, paying off a small amount every month through your work salary. Made up for him. We're gonna go and see that. And he's also told me there's a Sigma Sports out near um, where the bike shop is. So that's also a nice bit of bait for me to get there quick and have a look around and maybe pick up some bits for next week because we're off to the mountains. So I'm very excited to take you there. Uh, right, anyway. Go stop nattering, get back on the road. We're about 70k in, loving life. I've actually just cruised through some really lovely country lanes and the traffic's eased up, which is gorgeous. Absolutely glorious. I haven't actually seen a car in quite a while now. Making them all right time, just had a snack bar. I'm currently practicing my fueling at the moment because I'm not always the best at remembering to eat or to carry enough snack. I always do a hydration uh, bead on, which I'm absolutely loving, but in terms of bars and actual food, I'm trying to up my game because 312 is looming now, it's eight weeks to go. So not only do we need to ramp up the distance, but I need to get my fueling stuff in order as well and start to think about surviving in the heat and the hills. Oh, I am just over 100k in. And I won't lie, I'm feeling blooming cooked. Blooming. I'm on the most gorgeous road. Look at that. I'm surrounded by field. It can't get any nicer. Do you know what I mean? It's heaven. Eyes is definitely on route and car. 
I think I'm lagging way behind now, so I'm gonna try and put, pick up the pace. That has absolutely cracked me up because that is just where I'm heading. 130k. 30 left. 30 left. Thank God for you, it's snacks. <laughs> I'm off to get my bike. <laughs> How are you feeling about the bike? <laughs> Very good. <laughs> You've been like my, um, what's it called when the car gives food and drink? Director Sporty. <laughs> Director Sporty. It's honestly saved me. I'm feeling pooped. Alright, not long to go. I'm going to drive on and then I'll, when it, once I've got it, I'll just reverse the route. I'll find okay. you. With snack and drink. Or do you want me to wait there? I mean, if it's getting dark, I'll come find you. I think just come. Uh, how long are you going to be? It's only half an hour drive. Let's just see how it goes. Text me and I'll, I'll pull over. Drive right. safe. Happy bike day. Thanks for the snack. Can I hold on for a bit? Absolutely not. Can we do a sticky bottle? Eyes! <laughs> Eyes! Oh my God. I'm going to draft the car. <laughs> what the hell? Don't be stingy. Eyes! Bye. Found her. <laughs> what time did I joke that you were going to finish? You said six hours. And what time is it? It's good six hours. <laughs> <laughs> that was hilly. That was a hilly hundred. Hills have entered the chat. Oh. So somehow we're going to get that bike in there. Yeah? Happy with the bike? Love it. What have you got? What else have you got? Shoes. Got some new handlebars. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Right, should we get drink, food? 